Gary Neville is a close friend and former teammate of Beckham's. He spoke with Beckham about his decision to retire. Listen. You've just announced your retirement. Why now? Um, I think over the years, when I've seen players retire, um, you know, when you ask them about it, they always say they, you, you'll know when you're ready. And I think <laughs> I know when I'm ready. You know, I think I'm ready. Um, obviously, it's a difficult decision because I still feel that I can play at the top level um, and still have done for the last six months. But I always, you know, secretly said to myself that I want to go out at the top. Um, and if you'd have said to me eight months ago that I'd be playing in the French League, winning the French Cup, uh, winning the, the league, um, and finishing like this, uh, you know, I would have probably said, absolutely no chance but I was given the opportunity to come to PSG um, and I just feel now is is the time you think or you know I think yeah I, you know, I love the game so much you know mm -hmm. how much we love the game and um, I just feel that I don't know I don't know you know it's the right time I believe it's the right time um, but I, I'll always feel that I can do more, that's the problem. <laughs> when did that moment come? When did it hit you? Um, probably when Messi was running past me <laughs> <laughs> uh, in that home game. No. Um, when did I feel? I, I actually don't know. You know, I just, I just feel that I've been so lucky throughout my career. I just feel that, you know, the fact that I've played for the clubs that I've played for, the players that I've played with, won the trophies that I've won. Um, you know, playing in the MLS last year, uh, winning the championship there, and then coming to PSG and winning the, the French league here. Um, I think it's, you know, it's, it's a good way to go out. You've always gone out on a high at every club, at United winning the league, Madrid, MLS, LA Galaxy last year. Is that, is that important to you, what's happened in the last few weeks with PSG, that you've, you've gone out as a winner? Um, I think it's, it's every athlete's dream, every footballer's dream to go out on the top, uh, you know, on top form or winning a trophy. You know, it doesn't happen uh, that often, but, you know, I've been lucky. Obviously, when I left United, uh, we won the league. When I left, um, when I left Madrid, we won the league. Uh, like you said, leaving the Galaxy, you know, uh, doing uh, two years of winning the championship there. And then, obviously, coming here and winning the league. Um, it's nice to it's nice to go out like that, you know. I think people look back and you know, it's it's written, mm -hmm. you know. It's simple. You're leaving as a champion, and uh, I think that's why I think that it's the right time. How do you want to be remembered as a football player, as a person over the last 22 years and everything that you've achieved? As someone who did what, achieved what? What's most um, important to you? I just want people to, to see me as a as a hard-working footballer, someone that's passionate about the game and someone that every time I stepped on the pitch, um, I've given everything that I have um, because that's, a, that's how I feel going into games at the end of my career. That's how I, I look back on it and hope people will see me. Um, because I think over the years, it's been, you know, my, my life and my, my career, um, people have obviously looked at certain other things that have gone on throughout my career and I think um, sometimes that's overshadowed what I've done on the pitch or what I've achieved on the pitch um, and that's as much as I say that that doesn't hurt me of course it does you know I'm, I'm at the end of the day I'm a footballer that has played for some of the biggest clubs in the world played with some of the best players in the mm -hmm. world played for under the, some of the, the, the biggest and best managers uh, and, and achieved almost everything in football um, and I think, of course, it hurts when people not question it, but think about other things. Mm. And to come to the end of my career now and look back and say, you know, I've I've achieved everything with every club that I've played for, played for my country 115 times, been runner-up twice, uh, World Player of the mm. Year, uh, to two amazing footballers. Um, I'm I'm very proud of that.